Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Building the City. Um, my voice seems to be on the road to recovery now, so I'm sorry I had to put up with that last episode. But uh, yeah, I'm starting to like the look of this. I was just um, walking down the sidewalk here, as you'd say, and uh, I, I like the look of this street because it's, like, it's not flat and it's all busy as you walk along. You can see that there's a bit of a market here, we've got the trees overhanging and everything like goes in, it's not flat, so I'm really liking the way this is going so far. Um, and especially, uh, I like this kind of style of build, like, it's not ultra like modern, it's quite an old downtown feel to it, so I'm going to continue building in that, but um, I will, don't feel, uh, I will be building some proper like modern style buildings as well, but we're going to do them in little square blocks, so uh, that'll be for uh, quite a few episodes in the future anyway. Today, I'm going to be building something which was a suggestion by someone called uh, Peanut Butter Gone Wild, I think. So thank you for that. Um, and he said, oh, we should build some kind of fast food place. And I thought, well, we could do, or I could leave that to a uh, later episode where it's in a more modern building. But I thought, I might as well give it a go in one of these. So uh, yeah, let's, let's have a go at building a McDonald's, uh, is what I thought. Now, obviously, if you'd probably look at your local McDonald's, I don't know why I'm getting rid of this, this is just annoying me. If you probably look at your local McDonald's, it's probably quite a modern building uh, or whatever, especially if you're in America. But um, I'm going to have a go at, at building one onto like a bottom floor of one of these and have some apartments above it. So uh, yeah, I guess we'd better start and I'm going to try to do the inside as well because uh, a lot of people w were wanting to see some interior. So I will do that. So the episode might be a little bit longer, so I hope you don't mind. Now, I want to build some kind of like the front pillars about up to here, and I want them to be like solid white, but I'm not sure what to use. I might use the quartz actually. So let's get rid of the snow, put that in the bin there. We'll have to get rid of that bin, I think. Um, and then I want something like this, where they're just big old. Uh, blocks going up it's quite it's a very modern kind of look and then we'll have like big windows and have like these coming across joining them together so I think that would be enough for the gap in between and uh, yeah I'm still not 100% recovered because I've had like a really bad cold and <laughs> worst cold I've ever had been quite ill lately, so if I still sound a bit uh, not up to my usual self, then uh, you know why. I think that's okay. Yeah, I think that'll do. So one, two, three, four. We go. One, two, three, four. I don't want to make this really big, so I suppose. Well, this could be big enough as it is now. So we'll have a quick look, and then if it if it looks okay, then we'll just carry on from there. Uh, I mean that is quite small. Now I think we can do one more and it'll fit in nicely with the, uh, the amount of road we've built out already and I am um, by myself today so no one's joining me so it might be a bit of a, well it won't be as productive as last episode because I won't have someone being able to build the walls for me. But uh, no worries, we were just carry on. So, um, yeah, we're going to want to add in some windows. So first of all, let's just add these back, because we don't want the windows, um, like, right at the front. I think we could have just blocks, like glass blocks. So uh, that'll make a change. We can use yellow and just normal, I think, to give that mcdonalds -y feel. Maybe, oh, wait, I don't want it there, do I? gonna have to go out another unless I put uh well these sea lanterns down I think that'll be good because then it gives the light shining up so it's good to do like hidden lighting because sometimes just big blocks on the ceilings don't look too good all right let's just add these in quickly and hopefully this will look quite good and I'll delete that block in just a sec I hope it looks okay with that um yellow line go for it. I just wanted to have something so it wasn't too plain so it did kind of look like a McDonald's 
thing. Uh, yeah, I quite like that. And like I always say, it's when I uh, do the backs, it kind of brings a different feel. Because right, you can see into the, all these bright colours of the grass and stuff. So once it's a bit darker, now it'll look different. And this is quite a big building, I just saw in comparison. But it doesn't matter. This will be fine. Right. Um, I kind of wanted to have something... So... Ah, uh, I don't know. I was going to have something going across like that. But again, I, I wanted some... Uh, like, overhanging... Whatever they're called. Like, these bits. I always like them. I guess if we just add these in here, because that gives a modern feel, and then we can add all the non-modern stuff in in just a second. I quite like that. And then we can just go and add in some of these... Things. I don't know what they're called, the little overhanging, uh... oh, I've forgotten what they're called. Uh, no worries, actually, I don't want to use white. I was looking at some real pictures of McDonald's buildings before this to get some inspiration. I kind of had it like this, like an orangey and a yellow kind of thing, but I don't know if that blocks it out and it doesn't look that good. Actually, I think it looks okay from there, so we do that and there. We'll have a look. Oops, there you go, I did that wrong there. But yeah, I'm glad people are enjoying this because it's getting a good amount of views for me. So thank you for all tuning in and watching. Uh, yeah, I like that. Although I don't like the way I've done this out of uh, the pattern it was going in. Should go, yeah, white, oh, white, I mean yellow on the end here. There we are. Yeah, I think that's looking quite nice. I mean, they all, well, a lot of McDonald's tend to have this wooden part just jutting out. I don't know if it's the same for you, but in some of my local McDonald's, they have quite a lot of wood uh, showing, like these dark wooden pieces. Kind of hard to explain. Right. Um, I'm liking, look at this, yeah, like, this is a step into, like, the more modern builds. So as you can see, it's already quite a bit bigger. So I'm kind of worried about this being a bit too big. Hopefully it'll be okay. Uh, I'm wondering whether I should cut that one off so it's not as big. Uh, God, I need to make a decision now before I waste any more time. I think... Yeah, okay. We will. Making this decision, let's just cut this bit off here. I won't um I won't destroy it all because I don't wanna waste time. But I'll just cut this bit off here so we know not to build there. Because um I don't want it being too big and then looking completely out of place. Right, now we've got to build the kind of older style bit on top. But I could add like the McDonald's logo now. Is that yellowy enough? I think so. Right, how do we do this? Oh, I'm not going to be able to add it in the middle because it's not going to be symmetrical. So we're going to want that there, that there, and one here. There we are. And then... No, that's not right. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. <laughs> okay, I think that looks quite good. If we just add in the red background should be nice. It doesn't take up too much room either. Um, yeah, I'm down for that. Then we can just add in like a grey kind of thing to it. I guess if we add like something like this, so it's kind of modern, so it looks like uh, when they converted the old building there to add in some modern features. And where is... I still don't know, I've been playing this game for years, I still don't know where half the blocks are. Uh, if I do that, maybe, and then we can fill this in, like that, just so it doesn't look too bulky. There we go, okay. Um, now, what do I want to do for this? I literally have no idea what I wanted to do. I'll probably go... I think brown would look kind of cool, like a brown... And then add in bricks. Let's do something like this. One, two, three. One, two, three. That should be okay, I think. Then we could have 
windows which are like two by three. So like little rectangular windows, right? I think that goes like that. Here we are, one, two, three. Plant that there, one, two, three. Plant that there. And that's all we got to at that moment. Okay, right. Now, do I want to be building on that same level? Oh, yeah, I suppose we could, and then we might add in like some half subs on the on the border here, because as you can see, being just flat like that, I usually have the border sticking out, as you can see here. So I'll probably have to do something about that. I, no, I might just build back, to be honest. It might give some depth to the sign, too. Uh, I know I keep changing my mind and stuff in this episode, but... This is what happens when you uh, go in with only a brief little idea. Hopefully it's all look okay. I, was, I wasn't even going to uh, build a fast food today. I was going to build a fire station, but I'm going to save that for a different episode. I thought I'd uh, build what the subscribers want first. If you've got any more suggestions, please leave them in the comments. I love reading through them. I'm getting some good feedback as well, so thank you everybody for leaving lovely feedback much appreciated right that'll do for now yeah 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 yeah. i like this right um then we can go oh we could add a flower box right let's do that there and then say if we had another one like there just let's just say we had that there or even up here because that's where it will be and then that one would be there. Okay, so the next one would be right here. I'm just trying to find where the center is and stuff. Let's get rid of that, because actually that is too close. And to make a simple flower box, I'm sure you all know this, just cover it in the trapdoors, like so. And it's so handy now, you can place them below blocks. It's allowed me to do a lot uh, cooler designs, especially with things like different desks and stuff so uh, yeah let's add in a couple of flowers some uh, McDonald's coloured flowers here we are oh that oh that was a bit of lag there and then all we're going to want to do build up three blocks here and add some of the windows in and we can add a little half sub on top to give it a little uh, overhanging window ledge type thing. We can do that with just one of these. There we are. Yes, I'm liking this. Uh, don't want this to look a bit weird. So I could do it so it looks like it's being filled in. Uh, or, or do it with just plain colour maybe. Uh, yeah, I think that looks all right. And then we can add in some kind of separation, maybe. I might rearrange the borders a bit if we have time. But this episode might go on for a little bit longer. Maybe half an hour episode. We'll see what we get to. Right, let's do that. And then we could always have something going like this, maybe this. Actually, I'm not sure if that would look... No, no, I don't really like the look of that. Um, let's see, if I get rid of the top of that, then I can use this, because that's what I was using anyway for the stairs. Let's just do a very basic one, and then, like I do, I can just come in and um, rearrange things. So, again, flower pot, uh, flower boxes are me. We are put these in there underneath and there right and also want to say thank you for almost at the time of recording this I have uh, 449 subscribers so thank you for almost 500 subscribers it means a lot because uh, I never expected that and, uh, I did start this channel quite a long time ago when uh, I was about 11 or 12 I think and they say enjoy making little videos on the on Minecraft was quite new on the console and uh, yeah I just did that for fun and they uh, yeah, and that kind of sparked this off 
Right, what did we have? I think we just had these. Oops. We'll uh, add in the other flower. Where is it? There we are. Oh no, we had a different flower, didn't we? Oh, no worries. There we go. Oh, it's so difficult placing these by themselves. There we are. It'd be handy if they just stayed across for like, until you'd finished building. I, I wish they actually had mods on there. On the Xbox Minecraft, because I'd love to have proper. Uh, well, firstly, I'd love uh, working cars, especially for cities. Then I'd love to have uh, different foods, like fast food. Be really cool. Uh, I think I'm going to add a third layer and then add the roof, so it's going to be quite big anyway. Uh, how did we do this? Then we added another layer going across this and then I know there's definitely another layer here at least Give me that a second I need bigger inventories there and then there's a gap oh no I just chucked away the block I needed right I'm gonna need that block again probably right there, let's build that up there for time here this is the biggest building so far so I'm a little worried it'll look out of place but what you gonna do always going to feed be things which uh, don't always go according to plan. Right, where is this? So that just literally goes like that. And this should, we are, goes across it like so. Another block here. And... Yeah, actually, we don't have to have another full set. We can have a kind of, uh, how do I explain it? A little thing to represent it being a room in the attic kind of thing. So if we do this and then do just two like that, that could look quite cool. And oh, we could change up the glass again. I, I really like using the different kinds of glass. There we are, we could do this, like that. And there we go. Do another one here. Is that at that place? Yeah, just a bit of lag. Then we can just have the roof sitting on top. So I don't want to go too much uh, higher. So if we do something like maybe where's plain stone? Do that going across here. We can just have a nice little design going up and down. Oh yeah, this will look pretty cool. Do that there. Do that there. Hopefully, that'll look okay. Yeah, and then we could have... I wanted to add this. Just had a little idea. This might look a bit weird. Uh, I'm going to try it anyway. Wish you could put things in the centre. Do this. Oh, I think I like that. If it was a little bit thinner, it'd look better. But I do actually like that. So, I'm going to add one at the corner. It just kind of gives it a bit of a differentiation to the rest of it. Yeah, that's okay, I suppose. And then we can just add in, like we do with the rest of them, one uh, overhanging roof. To finish it off and uh, even if I didn't want to overrun we've still got five minutes I'm gonna try and do uh, the bottom floors back and then do the inside really quickly for you uh, I'm trying not to rush though because that's where things can go downhill let's have some buttons place them in Get rid of that one there, that one there, that one there, that one there, that'll do. Uh, yeah, I think that'll do. We might have to just get rid of something because it doesn't look brown enough up at the top here. So if I did that, hopefully, I think, yeah, that looks quite nice actually. 
tell me what you guys think as well. Right, so we need a door. Um, let's do one here. And oh no, my batteries have disconnected. Let me just quickly swap over. Actually, no, I'll plug the cable in so I don't have to waste any more time. Right, come on, there you are. Let's get this show on the road. What kind of doors do they have? I guess I have modern doors, and this is kind of the most modern one, and can't place blocks there. I guess that's kind of a McDonald's-y coloured door. And uh, I'm trying to think, the last time I went into McDonald's, what the floor was like. I think it was like white and uh, yellow. They have like the footprints of the uh, Ronald McDonald. <laughs> Yeah, I think this should look quite nice. Uh, here we are. I'll do the uh, walls in just a sec once I've built this. I just got a message from good old Botswana guest over at Beta God Gaming. He's doing a let's build of a medieval world, so if you want to check that out, just type in the Beta God, he might comment on this video. So yeah, it's worth checking out. It's a very good builder with medieval stuff. Right, do that there. Actually, let's quickly outline the wall because I don't know exactly where I'm going with this floor. And I don't want it to be too big. It's quite a nice little cosy McDonald's. We'll have a little kitchen built out the back because a lot of them do. I've noticed like a little uh, concrete uh, building going out the back. Uh, especially when they're on converted old buildings like in my local town, they've got one. Uh, similar to this. Right, if I do that, I should probably do all of one colour first so I don't have to keep switching. I kind of like doing these checkered floors. It's, it's uh, nice rather than just doing one colour and having to go back and forth and back and forth. Oops. There we go. Right, I'm going to do interior in a second, but I do warn you, and I've said before, I'm really not. Uh, that's good at interior. And what, do, what do walls look like in McDonald's? I don't know, but I suppose wood would look fine. Like this, maybe? Uh, I'm gonna do this anyway. There we go. Uh, but yeah, not great at uh, interiors, but I'm gonna try anyway, because you guys said you wanted to. Do. Uh, so it's going to be fairly simple with a restaurant, obviously the most, the main part of it is uh, tables and chairs and we've got to have the little checkout desk bit and obviously the kitchen where they'll get your Big Macs and all of that jazz. Uh, okay, so I suppose this will be good enough, like we can have a little staircase, I mean they have one in my local. Uh, McDonald's and I can't get messages from all sorts now and I I should probably turn the uh, thingies off notifications but uh, I'm sure it sh uh, won't bother you too much I hope not uh, this is going to overlap the window and look really weird oh no oh, I could have done it the other way why didn't I do that I'm going to do that uh, I'm sorry for all of this. I hope no one's following this step by step because I have to have deleted loads of stuff uh, as I have. Right, how, how do I do it? Right, this, like this, and then, and then all we want to do is build this up a bit, like so. We can have more of the uh, things upstairs, right? Do that in just a bit. So we walk in, la 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 la, and we've got the checkout area, the tills, right? We'll probably want to do it like this, a nice clean looking uh, checkout, and then we'll have a little uh, thing over here. Let's just have something white on the floor for a bit of cleanliness, and oh, I should have done that for this. See, look, I keep changing, I'm very sorry everyone. This uh, makes it look a lot less boring. And put one here. And then we're going to want to do the tills again. 
uh, we know how to do these. I've done this on my 100 plus um, furniture ideas. So if you haven't seen that, I definitely recommend. And, uh, in McDonald's, I usually have like little stands where they keep like I don't know to have like glass bits where they keep uh, your like muffins and stuff and little cookies that you can buy. Right, let's do some tables quickly and uh, actually we'll build out the back I've overrun this episode quite a bit right let's do this uh, let's do just something like this there we are just a checkered floor again don't need this kitchen to be too massive we want it decent enough to be able to cook for the whole building one more and that'll be absolutely fine but yeah it's very difficult trying to fit the whole uh, building into one episode so uh, maybe if I had a helper I'll be able to do it so I will uh, continue doing it I guess with practice it will come a lot easier there we go and then just uh, do we need this one yeah we do need a layer there and then all we want to do is have it like a very boring looking uh, concrete uh, building out the back. But I'm just going to finish this little bit off and I'm going to have to end the episode because it's already on um, overtime. And I should have deleted this tree beforehand. Right, come on. Now I am rushing because this isn't a hard build. And, uh, I didn't put any swiftness on. Oh, now I'm wasting even more time. I'm pushing blocks everywhere. Uh, there we go. Uh, delete, delete. Uh, uh, let's quickly build. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. This should do, and I can just build a normal looking roof over the top. And God, swiftness helps so much. Right, I might record another one straight after this. Um, and I'll probably do the interior of that for this ep for the uh, next episode. So if I just finish this off end the episode here so yeah thank you very much for watching i hope you've enjoyed this episode of what we've done so far of the mcdonald's as you can see it's come along quite nicely in uh, about 25 minutes but yeah thank you very much for watching stay tuned comment what you thought if you've got any other ideas as well and uh, i will see you later